Eric B's Daily Vlogs. With a nice view of the Presidio Cemetery and at a distance, the Golden Gate Bridge. A lot of history here in the Presidio and the perfect one for Ghosttober is the Presidio Chapel. Let's get this started. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Welcome everyone, it's my daily vlog channel, Eric B's Daily Vlogs. Ghost-tober is here. I want to touch up on something. Someone came up to me and brought something up to my attention and said, Hey, why are you talking about ghost sightings of things that we haven't heard of? Because you have your popular ghost sightings like Alcatraz, the Queen Anne, all these things that if you Google San Francisco hauntings, you'll find them on the internet. I'm bringing you guys places and hauntings that you can only find if you do research. And one of them is right up in that tower, the main chapel here in the Presidio, the first chapel built here by the Colonial Army, and the haunting sites right there in that tower for Ghost Tober. Let's go. So again, not that far from the military cemetery, which is right over there in the distance. But this chapel served part of the American War when people would come and pray. People, if they're on their last death, would die, would come here and pray. And then the ghost rumor is this area right here when we walk up this area, there's someone that walks around in this area right here. You see, I'm not even walking towards it because I'm a little frightened and it's almost nighttime. Not quite. But then the rumor has it that there's someone that's always peeking out right there. And it's, I know it's this one because there's four-sided windows or four sides to that tower but it's always that one that they're peeking out of and you could always see someone wandering and hanging out in that little gazebo right over there a little apparition either dressed in white or military black and they're wandering around over here maybe someone even whose final resting place is over there Maybe, but they're supposed to be up there. They are. Now over here by the gazebo, you got a little gazebo, nice little gazebo. You got a little memorial right here. Vietnam, to all the Vietnam veterans. Right here, you got a little memorial. I'm hearing movement over here, but then there's the other bell tower right there. Now, not sure what how the story goes who is the person up there that is haunting the tower maybe an old military person that was here maybe someone who prayed for him not to lose their life and then they did but there's the story the rumor again they walk around this area gazebo this street the front of the chapel and making their way back to the cemetery. In my last vlog, I was in a suicide force up, up a distance over in the Sutro, Sutro neighborhood. And right there in the woods, I'm hearing a lot of noises again. It's windy. It's, you know, it's windy, so I'm probably hearing noises from the wind. But that's what I'm here for today. The haunted chapel here in the Presidio. A little creepy because if you pan around, it's really nothing here right now. Again, you got the chapel, 
you got the cemetery, and you got the creepy woods right behind me over there. Creepy. I told myself I'm not going to get any closer than I am to the church, but there's a little description right here that I think we should all read together. It's called the Post Chapel. And again, there's some artwork in here that Diego Rivera had something to do with. And then this person right here, right there, German-born, came from Germany, came over here and did the artwork inside. You can barely see the artwork inside. I'm hoping nobody's staring at me through the window. But pretty cool artwork inside. Again, colonial Spanish times kind of artwork in there. You can, when, when it's open, you can definitely come in here and check the artwork out. Again, Diego Rivera, a lot of Diego Rivera influence when it comes to the artwork. But that's for another vlog, that's for another time, because for this Ghost-tober, we're talking about the creepiness of this area. And the creepiness... Whoa, what was that? What was that? I literally just heard somebody up there. Whoa, let's back this up a little bit. Whoa, I swear. I just heard, like... I don't know. I don't know if you if you heard that. I don't know if I caught it, but I did hear something up there. It sounded sounded like someone was trying to say something or talk to me. There's nobody here. Nobody around here. Those woods look kind of creepy. But I heard a voice coming from up there. I'm going to have to watch and post again. Because in my last video. My last video when I was at the Sutro Towers. Or Sutro Forest. I heard some giggling. And some strange voices up there. Did I catch that again? In my last video like I just mentioned. I did hear some giggling. I heard some voices. And just right now. Up in that tower, on the other side, I did hear what sounded like someone was saying something or talking. I'm not sure if you guys heard it, but I heard it, and it's a little creepy. It's a little, little, little creepy, but I don't see anybody wandering. I don't see anybody walking by. It's cold, and that's why I'm a little creeped out, but it's just cold. Alright guys, that's going to do it. Ghost-tober will continue again tomorrow with a different haunted location, a different haunted site. Again, not the normal haunted stories you hear about San Francisco, the famous haunted ones. These are the ones that are a little more you haven't really heard of till you did research. Like the one up in here. The one up in there. The ghost of the Presidio Main Chapel hangs out right there. And wanders this area. I'm not that far from the, um, the officers club where I did the ghost of the lady dressed in black that got murdered in that area. I'm not that far from there. And again, the Presidio National Cemetery is right there. So 
there definitely could be a lot of things that's going on right here. I got all the birds who are singing right now who they probably know something's going on. I got a big gust of wind at the same time that's coming up. Coming up. I'm hearing things. Other than the birds, something is definitely coming up, coming from up there. Definitely. Thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me comments down below. See? There's something out there. Weird. A little eerie. A little eerie. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm about to go, because now I'm freaking myself out. Vlog's ended, guys. Thanks for watching. Go in peace. Not sure who you are that's trying to talk to me or reach up to me from up there. But if you're there, and you're there making noise, don't follow me home, please. Don't follow me home.